There's one type left now uh, when it comes to interior mutability that we're going to look at, and it is called a RW lock. And this means a read write lock, and it's basically almost the same as a mutex. If you look at the uh, the let's see where did it go? <clears throat> let's just compare the two. So we have a read write lock here, and then we have a mutex over here. And you can see the uh, the methods are basically the same. You've got get mute. You've got uh, into inner is poisoned. That means if it if it panics, if you have multiple threads and one panics, it's called uh, <clears throat> then it becomes poisoned. Then you have uh, and then there's new. And then uh, in mutex, you know you've got lock. And then you've got try lock, which is uh, you know you uh, you'll try getting a lock, and if you don't get it, then you just give up. And this one has. Uh, read and uh, write and it has try read and try write and before uh, we ex we look at that I'll explain why you would want to use a uh, read write lock so let's say uh, here's basically the same example as last time with a mutex uh, so we have this uh, this book and we've decided for whatever reason <clears throat> that we want to have a mutex for everything we don't want to declare it as uh, as mutable um, there's no good reason for that here but uh, just to uh, just to show that we can do this so we uh, we make a book and we put everything each one goes inside a mutex and then uh, we have this uh, you know we, we get a lock from each one so we make this variable called title get a lock author gets a lock year gets a lock and then um, now we can print uh, we can print these out uh, we can say uh, you know what uh, what's title so we can do this <clears throat> And it'll just you know show what uh, the data that's inside. You can see it says uh, the crystal cave. So that's fine. We can access it that way. But if we want to uh, you know take a look at the original struct, everything is going to be locked. So uh, right here you can see title uh, is locked, author locked, year locked, and that is where a uh, a read write lock is uh, is useful because instead of uh, instead of lock. You have uh, you have read and you have write, and these follow the same rules as uh, references. So read, you can have only one, right? You can have uh, you can have many, and you can have you know one hundred writes. Oh, sorry, the other way around. Read, you can have many, right? You can have uh, only one. So um, yeah, you can have you know 100, 100 reads. That's fine. Uh, write, uh, you can only have one, and you can't have read and write together. And uh, because it's a, uh, it's basically the same as a mutex, it's not going to panic. It'll just, uh, you know, stand there forever, and your program is going to time out. So uh, the, uh, so you know, you can, uh, you can write it basically the same as a mutex, and you just uh, read write lock. So let's just change all of that because there's seven, seven of them. So make them all read write locks um, <clears throat> and then instead of lock we are going to have write actually let's do read first so there we go read unwrap read and unwrap so we're getting a read lock so these uh, you know they don't need to, need to be mutable right now because we're just reading but uh, that's what rest is telling us here it doesn't need to be mute so that's uh, that's helpful you can see uh, it's got the data here, the Crystal Cave, Mary Stewart, uh, 1970, so we can do that. Uh, right, let's try that. Right.unwrap, and then take a look there. And you can see it's only when uh, when you have write that it behaves just like a mutex. So you go inside, the data is totally locked, but if it's, uh, if it's just read access, then you can, uh, you can still look at things. And so, um, and then after that, you know, if you have a, if you have write access, then you, uh, you would just do the same as with uh, with a mutex. So you would say like uh, title um, equals uh, the uh, what's it called? Let's change it to the Hollow Hills again, and then uh, you know just change that, and then that works fine. So let's. Uh, Let's drop it. Let's drop title. And now this uh, this reference is gone. And then let's see if uh, 
let's see what we can see. So my book should be, uh, you know, we have two, two right locks still around. So these two should be locked and uh, this one should be fine because uh, it's gone. So you can see, uh, you know, the hollow hills has uh, it's been changed to the hollow hills. We dropped it and the rest of them are uh, are still there. So it is locked. So it's basically, you know, almost exactly the same as a mutex. So uh, just uh, if you get good at mutexes and you find that, uh, you know, you want to view your data, then just change it to a rewrite read write lock. And uh, it's as simple as that.